All right, so I want to give a brief overview today on the capabilities of locking out the clutch with the FAB and RAF series of clutch control drivers. Um, basically, the great thing is with every FAB and RAF driver, uh, there is a built-in lockout mechanism on the clutch. Um, it's simply accessed by removing the silver ring, and you can kind of see here we actually have a set screw exposed. Um, this is a breakdown of the front end of the driver. Uh, in, the, uh, in the actual clutch adjustment cover, there's a pre-threaded hole um, that accepts the very small set screw. Uh, there's also a non-threaded hole for the detent ball. Uh, basically, once those are installed, you have this silver ring here that simply attaches to the front of the driver and basically just covers up both so they're not as easily accessed. Uh, with each driver for the Fab and Raft series, when they're shipped out, you receive something we call a T-Pack. It's basically the Allen wrench, the small set screw, the detent ball, and a set of instructions on how to lock the cover out. The important thing to note with these, and this is in the instructions shown on the T-Pack, is you do not want to tighten down over the reference guide here. The reference guide is basically just a set of numbers that you can use to reference once torque is set on multiple drivers. It's just an easy way to set it up. If you tighten the set screw over this, the metal's thinner and it's going to cause uh, basically it to indent and then it will cause problems with the clutch.